Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, whenever and wherever you are. And welcome back to the beat up plan as we have returned to our Jewish gem campaign within Crusader Kings 2. With a realm that is already uh, hard to get on the entire screen, certainly because of this weird issue. So I said I would revoke things, but apparently I lied. The fact that I am Mizra helped in this regard to actually convince all these nice people over here to turn Jewish. And that is what I have done. Hopefully they will convince their little vassals. They haven't done so just yet, besides this person hate him anyway, so... Revoke vassal titles. Ah, he's revoking stuff. Fine. He is revoking vassal titles, but I convinced them to become Jewish. The fact of the matter is that this is the bloody Abbasid dynasty. I don't really want to get rid of it. I have to admit, though, later on, I did find a leansy teensy tiny mistake. I mean, this dynasty comes directly from the Emperor. That is awesome. But this is the original Africa line that was married to my grandmother. Then this becomes a line, and then, oh, oops, it's no more there, because this man died, and actually this man is still alive. I should have given it to him and then tried to get him rid from Jazidi. But then again, his son actually does have something over here. He is a duke. He, he does have very little, because he doesn't have his own duchy, as he should have, but... At least our line is there as well. But yes, this is the Abbasid dynasty. And thus, I actually kind of wanted to keep them on the throne. He is a usurper. We haven't gained everything here. And that is a little bit of a shame. In fact, it's a big shame because we did gain 50% threat range for this war. Look at that. Abbasid claim an Africa war. 50%. So I'm going to have to chill. But I also can do that quite proper with Cedar Realm Prosper, because there is not much to attack, just offensive. And funnily enough, regarding my son, well, he has just come of age. We have groomed him to perfection, he is brawny, gregarious, ambitious, and unfortunately he didn't get brave, he got proud, but he became like daddy a military strategist, and he is a siege leader, which isn't really bad at all. So. I'm just gonna say I'm happy with that, and I've just said, like, hey, we've got a marriage here. Please, please come over here, and yes, they do indeed. I'm gonna say no people respect wealth, because I did lose quite a bit of prestige for that. Um, breaking of the <clears throat> truce, I really am a little bit annoyed. By the way, I this dynasty used to be originally, I believe, the kings here, so yeah, this dynasty, I... I want to help you out, but I looked at it and it's all bloody Sunni nowadays. The only dynasty that I could confirm here was the Abbasid over here. And that I kind of like because they were originally Jewish emperors. I still hold quite a few of his daughters and what have you not prisoner, so I can certainly ransom some a little bit. He still has a negative monthly balance, supposedly, so I don't know when that's gonna happen, but we'll have to see. I just need to look a little bit at Jazidi Revolt and see and hopefully hope that we can actually attack him. Be as soon as he has created his nation, we can go and say, hey, we'll attack you uh, for Holy War before he joins any freaking defensive pact because it is huge. This is what everything that's in the defensive pact. So I hope. I wouldn't mind if, if he wins uh, the Abbasid Empire, that way he will just chill. Um, this guy is going for the Holy War for Tripotelania, so he's already going for this, trying to gain the lands that were supposedly within this territory. I might just give... I don't know if I want to give him away and give him to uh, the King of Africa. Because, uh, well, currently he's Agnetic Gavokine. He will split up a little bit. And then, perhaps we can get some lands from him. Well, we can give them to the African King and keep our Duke as a separate entity. But then again, he's very powerful. And he wants to be on the council. And if we can manage to un well, undo that or, or just not have problems with that, it wouldn't be too bad. We have a possible apostate. It seems like it. Yes, he's highly suspicious. Uh, burn the apostate. I do not want to see issues regarding this again. Oh, he already has inherited this, apparently. 
Hold on there. Mystery. Inherited, and you were died under suspicious circumstances, despite your thing. Despite your uh, elusive shadow, but you were a possible Sunni, and you are not, so I'm gonna say, well done. Yes, we are burning apostates. I don't want another Sunni uprising to undo all this Jew lovely Jewish territory that we are gaining. And this is the only holy site that we still need to gain, and unfortunately this is under current Sunni control. So, that's a little too bad. This is great, I feel stronger. I won't give up, I feel stronger, I am already strong, but I thought that would give you brawny. Uh, why do I click on this? But yeah, my son here... Uh, sympathy for the Islam. Well, luckily I will control him later on and then it will be uh, a null avoid thing, but jeez. Uh, you can oversee the construction. That's fine by me. Um, speaking of overseeing construction, we can probably build some more stuff around here. So let's do that. I also, as you may notice at the beginning of the episode, I've built up my retinue a little bit more. It's going to be 6,600 men now. There's going to be a lot of additional archers and a bit of heavy infantry. So that our army's a little bit rounded out. They're not good for chasing. They are good uh, for just initial bouts and battles. Um, do -do -do. Let's give you something. The Seneschal will go to the Duke of Alexandria. And I need a new commander, who can definitely be my son. And yeah, I fully ex I wouldn't be surprised if Alexandria wins here. But if you don't like a slow down, easy episode, in which we don't make any war and just make friends, then this isn't the episode for you, and I fully understand if you would go away. I... Uh, not aggression pact. A wonderful idea. Won't you join the Empire? I need to click on you in a proper manner and then say offer vassalization. You say no. Not my de jour liege. True. True. We have a non-aggression pack now. Why did I sign this? I can break it, but then I will have a lot of people being angry with me, so I'm not gonna do that. And we can always do it later. You. You are highly suspicious, Bernie Apostate. There we go. I've had enough of this. Um, we could bump military organization, but we are far, far ahead of time. Yeah, that is uh, getting a little too crazy here. Let's bump up the, those two and leave it at that for now. Um, improved keeps is castle fortification. This will help with the hospital. We're not too crazy out of time. Let's put do that one. Um, and then because of that, let's look at our hospitals. Look at that. We can definitely now increase the hospitals like crazy. Temple Vassal Opinion. Uh, disease resistance. Temple Vassal Opinion. What's... These do exactly the same, except that the soup kitchen is less than half the price. Technology spread. First the library, then we'll do the rest. I don't think we have any technological spread of the hospitals. No. Is there a hospital already here? Yes, there is. Okay, so there is... Oh man, he has even a better... Hospital than I do, that's... I can't stand for that. I do believe the Jazzini Uprising is losing now. I do think this is the battle. This is him. What is this then? I can't click on this. What is this? Idle Councilman. Spymaster. Oh, apparently we uh, got ourselves some stuff that we shouldn't have. The right put band still in power over here. Uh, decline. I'm not going to come to your rescue, my dear boy. Uh, where are you? Akuria. Over here. Oh, that really has no, no use. 
Oh, well. Oh, there we have a daughter. But it's a daughter, so it doesn't matter that she isn't strong. Oh, by the way, we don't have strength, of course, anymore in the family. Oh, that's okay. Oh. I can't burn her. I can throw her in the dungeon. Otherwise, I would get Kinslayer, and that is not something I am happy about. Shola is adamant. She tries to make an appointment with one of her male friends, who might mean more to her than I earlier suspected. Stuart, which is my son. So I'm not so crazy and strange about it, but I'm not going to give my son the steward position because I need people in power. I do hope that this King of Africa will regain his strength, and he is slowly doing that, so that he might be able to attack from the opposite empire for this little territory. I should really turn this off because it always. For some reason, it bothers me. And it makes no particular sense, no rhyme or reason, but. Just seeing that thing pop up constantly, like, hey! Did you know? And I'm like, yeah, I knew. You don't need to tell me. There you go. Uh, life will be your reward. Consentience and shrewd. My daughters are absolutely fine. I can't change the law by now, by the, by the way, because, well, vassals are fighting one another. No vassals are fighting each other, and that's happening. You should work for me, a most impressive woman. She will work for me. You will hate me, but like me... Nope. Not just like me, you will just really hate me. But I will talk to you, and you are old as F. Sorry, but you're 60, you have cancer, you're also highly suspicious. So, I'm not too afraid of saying, eh, maybe not. Oh. That has bumped up to the fact that if he is the heir to be, then they will have a claim to the Empire. Which is unfortunate, because that is, of course, a penalty. This guy already has a penalty for uh, title claimant minus 20, and that's because of a small little claim on Pelusia. Oh. But, alright. This lady, you are definitely going to help me get Prosper, because you have a big chance of doing it, and we really need to Prosper. We've, on we've only won, and sometimes zero. So now we have a truly powerful lady that can help us Improve our economy. Uh, my dear girl, go for consensus. Uh, prepare food and supplies to be handed out to charity. The prosperity of the county will increase slightly. Of course. Uh, can make it a gift of the emperor. I am already proud, so Henshin won't add anything. I can say it was zealousness. I kind of want to make that one. I mean, this will give you more points to your score in the end, but I don't really, really don't care. Uh, and I do care for getting zealous, but I didn't get it. Oh, well. Nope. I'm just not going to bother with that anymore. Join the existing defensive pact. Yes, well, whatever. I will reassure him. I mean, uh, that's fine. Get out of here. Library has been built. Sunni Uprising. Cursed infidels. Oh, and they're immediately dealing with this, so that means Nubia will win. And not that they already had a big chance, but that is what it is. And this is not a war that helps me against Prosper, huh? because otherwise I would be a bit pissed. Yeah, no, it uh, doesn't bother me, me that way. Um, I still have many, many prisoners. I didn't realize. Uh, library was also built, so we have more tech spread. And then we'll build the soup kitchen. Yep. Soup kitchen. Then we'll build a leper colony. We're going to make sure that we have a little bit less trouble with diseases. Because, well, the Black Death would also still arrive somewhere. But <laughs> we put it on historical. By that time, we will have a strong, strong hospital. It's only 922. And already we all have expended this much. And this duke... This duke's war is already 39% in his favor. Revoke the Duchy of Makuria. That is a shame in a sense because it was a strong.
Hamadan has declared war upon me. That must be one of those events where they've been asked to go to war for me and he had to accept. Because that's not a war you can win. And that did cancel my ambition. Look, I don't want to be annoying, but I didn't start this war. So how am I supposed to prosper if I try and be nice and you just don't allow me to be nice? I mean, that's kind of bull. 7 November. Yeah, we, the problem is we've lost our guy that can move quick. 7 of November. Raise the army. Let's see if we will arrive in time and we do. Goodbye. That was taken care of. Nope. You. No, not history. You. Offer peace. Enforce the man's. Get your head chopped off. Nope, sorry. We burn them at the stake. We don't chop heads off. We burn them at the stake. We are civilized. <clears throat> Taste the irony in my voice. Oh, ye of a little faith. Uh, there you are. 2,000 men. I'm just gonna do that with my original. Thank you very much. That'll be enough. Uh, you gave Trickster to this guy? Not really that good, but okay. Oh. Little lag. Little lag. Stop asking me for my daughters. You are even in defensive pact against me. You are of a different religion. Why would I ever do that? Well, oh, Bohemia also has one. Bohemia has totally been broken up. And this man is... Catholic. Which is probably causing all kinds of issues here for him. Bohemia, po I think Bohemia, Poland, and Pannonia are all of the same dynasty. Well done, Moimerit. Really, that is amazing. That is like a player. This, this is an especially well done. This is a mess. This is a horrible mess. Lombard is the one that looks looks good. The rest is just a. Freaking mess. Oh, you want this back. For a short moment. Oh, I think he just want this back. Considering some of them are still... Uh, here, but you can actually even still see it. This man over here, uh, who lives over here, holds the duchy of the province. This was for a short moment time part of the Zurayid, who has slowly been kicking out the Umayyad. Yeah, the original dynasty, but they have lost their title already a long time ago. The oldest Sultanate of Marincia. Fez is still holding on to their titles. Well done. So yeah, that five years of peace, I try to, folks. But unfortunately, I... People just want to wage war against me. I mean, I am not the culprit here. I'm just spreading the Jewish faith. That they did not give me back peacefully the African title. It's their fault, you know. Look at... Look at my daughters! They're amazing! Shrewd, diligent, patient, Midas touched. Matrilineal marriage. Um. Is this a. Heir to the kingdom of Abyssinia. Oh, no, 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 no. We can't do that. Commander of Bagender, but he might be Sunni. Secretly. Why are there so many secretly Sunnis? I don't get it also in a sense, is because... Let's, let's just look at the religion, right? Jewish, 100. Sunni, 30.4. I wish that um, in the event, when you find a Quran, it's not just a weighted thing of... I will choose option 1 or 2 for the computer, but then they will also weight in the amount of moral authority. And if their liege is of a certain religion. Because that might mean they get their heads chopped off. I think it's spreading a little too fast for my liking. It's Catholicism, Jewism and Hinduism. And Orthodox is doing decently well. And then it becomes a little bit... 
So, why the amount of Sunnis? You know, your yeah, Jewism, it's spreading. It's slow. It's going. It's slow going, but it's spreading. Here, this boy, even you are awesome. You are Ethiopian. Oh, this is a Gideon. What's past the Gideon? Who's well done? Sympathy for. Interesting. You got your ass kicked. How many wars do you still have, Abyssinian Empire? I'm just gonna click on you for real. Uh, defending against Count of Kaffa the Quarter. Smart move. He's I, is this in a holy war or a holy war from the fount? He is going for. Let me see. The Dutch is these four, and these are currently very weak. But I do fear that he's gonna have to go up against the Jesse the Uprising. But this terrain here is very weak. So despite the fact that he has only 800 men, he is... It's not a bad decision, but I think he's not doing it right. And then we have defending against Shai Khalil of Kufano Kuf... You. Are you also going for the Holy War? Also for a Holy War for Nefout. Okay. We'll have to see. Who wins what? Because of just the Uprising here, we'll have something to say about that. I'm not even sure for what I am defending. For the entire title. I really shouldn't. I won't give up. Ah, the daughter of... The only daughter of my sister before she suicided herself. And she asked daddy if he could please get the title for her. Your heir with this princess. Decline. And she has sympathy for Judaism. Uh, for Sunni. Shoot. Oh, is it lit? Is that a... No. But he's way too old. And down here, I'm going here. I'm not running all the older rabbis. They're both have sympathy for Judaism, for uh, for the Islam. Let's try this. Judge of Simeon. Hi. Do you still feel comfortable in your declaration of war, good sir? I would advise you to turn back with the, your tail between your leg, cry, and wonder why in the heck you listen to your daughter. She loves him. Oh, they're friends as well. That is a... I, hold on, I need to look back at the daughter for a moment. Uh, here, go for intrigue. Yeah, intrigue focused. Flamboyant schemer. No, oh, she's not flamboyant, I think. She thinks she's done really, really smart. How's our Fred doing? 46.1. It's at least lowering, but I, it, it really needs to lower incredibly. Of course, we're going to get another 50% when we attack for this kingdom. Whenever we can possibly do it. But, uh, yeah. Oh, my son gained greedy. Eh, I don't mind that he has a good diplomacy, and ever, as everybody knows, I, I don't think greedy is a horrible trait. Get out of here. But it would be good to link up these Jewish lands as well. Oh, and he is spread Jewish over here. Very nice. The old, who is stressed, cancerous. Is a lunatic and is possessed. You, you, my man, have a few trouble. Satram the Fat has usurped the title of Master of Leptis of Magna. From Abgar, you got something from him and you have nothing. 
gotta explain that one to me, because that is just a little weird. What was the title? It's over here. Um, nope, it's just that my vassal just won his war. This has been, by the way, a very good vassal to me. I mean, they're still freaking Egyptian, which I probably should have taken into account for once. Um, are you... You're nearly done. Look, can I have your boy for a moment, assigned guardian, give him the highest honors, the emperor will do it, yes. Wonderful. Get some extra tech points. And I know this is going to make him totally shit. Oh, I can't change that anymore. Uh, because he's not younger than 10. Okay, well, we'll just have to be lucky then. Hopefully he will turn 2. Yes, I know I have an unlended son, but... Did that just pop up, or did just something just go away that caused that shift? I had the feeling it shifted over here. Okay, let's see and look here. That has been claimed. This is currently under control of the Shaitam of Kufa. Uh... You should focus on bravery, which made him honest for some reason. That sucks, but at least he's Ethiopian. And he is brave. That makes mm, people like him a little better. There you go. The Hashimit are now Ethiopian Jews. That is what I like to see, and the same I would prefer to see for this man. Um, you, my boy, also needs to be trained as a sign guardian. Uh, Ethiopian religious, is that... Yeah, let's do that. Assigned guardian. Oh, she's shy. That's not gonna help. He's gregarious, my son. And then we're going to ask if we can change his permission to do it to heritage focus. He will be taught well. And now, we have a chance of making him Ethiopian, an Ethiopian Jew on the African throne. That sounds like a good idea. Uh, somebody just joined the defensive pact against me. Should have checked which... If a new land had been formed. How well is the Jazidi uprising doing? 63%. Where's my army located at? Let's get it down and ready. 63%, he might get one county over here. I think my vassal army just got kicked. No, he missed it, apparently. And there you die. And there my daughter then... My sister, sorry, comes to the throne, and then we will have somebody with a claim to the Imperial throne. Which is really, really bad. What in the world? I thought I taught I... I thought I taught you a lesson. You twit. I need to make this into a, a hill fort, otherwise they will go away. Underhanded rogue? Very good, I don't think so, but I'll just take it, I guess. Let's return to my court. Alright. Oh, hold on. What do you want? Is that your heir to be? Then it's a decline. Your daughter, Ayana, has asked you to consider her for the position of steward on the council. Uh, no. Because I have a better one... Uh, why did I click on that? I have a better candidate. I can't catch you. Then I'm just gonna free you. And I'm gonna free you. And then I will just chase you down. Hopefully we will finish that in this episode. My daughter, I already have enough problems with people that I have actually put a woman on that position. And I have to admit, also a commoner, but still... Oh, another war. Why do I get a message of defeat over here? This is nothing to do. This is another Jazidi uprising. I possibly could expand that in way. Where are you going? You know what? Call up these troops for a moment, just to slow them down. There we go. We slowed it down enough that we can attack them. That's all I wanted. Thank you. Um. Oh, I think the Justini uprising has been cancelled. All right, then it means we're gonna go this way because apparently nobody wants me to have peace, anyways. 
And we might have a Jazidi realm over here that we will holy war against, even with all the friggin' defensive pacts in the world. Because they won't be in it. Kingdom of Arabia, Duchy of Tripotilania. Yes, but I want to wait until you are dead, to be honest. You can create it yourself. If you create it yourself... Well, if I create it, it will be... Hold on, if I do this, if I never give it to him, will then split in two? Because this is gavel kind. And if I create... Let's just create it. Grant down the title. I mean, he did win that war just for me. So, what happens with the... Let him calculate for two days or so. Heir to the Quadrant Emirat. So, yes, that means that he will get the other duchy title. Awesome. That is good. Then we can wait until he dies, and then we can give Tupitalania to this king again, and then we will get it through Africa. Focus again. Awesome. And you... Good sir, you are an idiot. In fool's demands, give me a ton of cash. You don't have that cash. You are in trouble. And this woman is imprisoned. By me. Oh. Uh, recruiter. None of these. M none of these must be true. Is a lover of what? That seems weird. I think it's about the opinion difference, and that is never... He, she thinks a hundred of him and minus one of me, so that's never going to happen. Um, Alright, hold on for a moment, and then we'll finish up the episode. It's been going on long enough already, actually. Let's build the expanded sick house. Let's do the fortifications... Why? Because I kind of misclicked, actually, because you really don't need that. But, uh, yeah, um, do, 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 do. we'll come back probably when I place my army over here. Maybe we can attack over here. What is our current threat level? It's at least going down. It's 44.3%. That means that every not everybody is going to band together against me should I wage a war. But that war is going to be in the next episode. So, yeah, thank you for watching. And remember, great peril yields great beauty.